While the Mojave Desert in the USA is generally sparsely populated, it has become increasingly urbanized in recent years. Its settlements include Las Vegas, the largest urban area in the Mojave, with a population of about 2.3 million. Las Vegas is a major global tourism destination, attracting millions of visitors annually and serving as the entertainment capital of the world. The city is renowned for its luxurious casino hotels, diverse attractions and entertainment scene. Though in a number of ways, it owes its dramatic rise to one of the most famous engineering projects in the world, the Hoover Dam. In the early 1900s, American Southwest communities were struggling to grow due to limited water access. Flooding of the Colorado River and droughts plagued the surrounding areas, creating a need for a reliable water source and flood control. A dam on the west's largest river, the Colorado, would create a massive reservoir to manage growth, as well as provide hydroelectric power to millions. Experiments with irrigation on a limited scale had shown that this arid region could be transformed into fertile cropland if only the river could be controlled. The Bureau of Reclamation spent more than two decades researching and investigating until they found the perfect location on the mighty Colorado River and construction began in early 1931. Built during the Great Depression, it provided jobs, electricity and water to an arid region that could experience extreme temperatures, ultimately playing a key role in the growth of Las Vegas. The Hoover Dam's construction transformed Las Vegas from a small railroad town into a major entertainment hub. The project drew workers to the area, swelling the population of the settlement from around 5,000 to 25,000. The influx of mostly male workers, with no local ties, created a market for large-scale entertainment. This led to the development of casinos, showgirl theatres and other entertainment venues that have continued to thrive to this day. The dam was constructed so that it is 200 metres thick at the bottom and only 14 metres near the top. The vast weight of water is held back by a curved face that transmits the water's force into the rock walls of the canyon, preventing its collapse. Such a large concrete structure had never been built before and some of the methods the engineers used were completely new and untried. Because of dangerous conditions and working practices at that time, at least 96 lives were lost in industrial accidents during construction. The cost of the Hoover Dam was $49 million, approximately $1 billion in today's terms. The power plant and generators cost an additional $71 million, more than the cost of the dam itself. It now controls the flooding of the Colorado River, irrigates more than 1.5 million acres of land, and provides water to more than 16 million people. Power generated by the dam provides energy to power over 500,000 homes. Behind the Hoover Dam, a massive reservoir was created, known as Lake Mead, which is critical for managing water supply in the region. Las Vegas relies heavily on Lake Mead for its water supply, primarily receiving about 90% of its water from the Colorado River, which is stored in Lake Mead. In addition to Lake Mead, Las Vegas also uses groundwater, pumped from the Las Vegas Valley groundwater basin, making up about 10% of the city's water supply. Hoover Dam has become a tourist attraction in its own right, welcoming around 7 million tourists annually. It's just a 45 minute drive from the Las Vegas Strip and 30 miles southeast of Las Vegas, 
So families, groups of friends and solo travellers who want a day trip can easily schedule a tour. Lake Mead supports recreational activities and provides habitats to fish and wildlife. The white band around Lake Mead shows the maximum extent of water storage in the reservoir. The Colorado River has endured more than 20 years of severe drought, which has reduced the amount of water in Lake Mead. The water level of Lake Mead has dropped more than 150 feet since 2000 and was last at full capacity in 1983. Low water levels in 2021 resulted in the first ever shortage declaration on the Colorado River, reducing the amount of water available. In response, Southern Nevada became one of the few places on the planet that recycles all indoor water on a community-wide scale. Approximately 40% of the water in the area is used indoors. Of that, about 99% is recycled, either for direct or indirect use. Direct reuse involves capturing, treating and reusing wastewater to irrigate parks, golf courses and other uses. Indirect reuse involves the highly treated wastewater being returned to the Colorado River via the Las Vegas wash which flows into Lake Mead. Strict rules around water use are in place for example, in Las Vegas, during the summer months, watering gardens is prohibited between 11am and 7pm to minimise evaporation. Areas are each assigned days when they can water their gardens and watering on Sundays is prohibited year round. As a result of these and other restrictions, Las Vegas used 38 billion gallons less water in 2024 than in 2002. And there was a population increase of approximately 829,000 residents during that time. It represents a 55% decline in per capita water use and offers some hope for the future. We have seen that despite the challenges of developing hot desert environments, which include extreme temperatures, water supply and inaccessibility, hot desert environments can offer development opportunities, which include energy production, farming and tourism. The Hoover Dam is supplying water and helping to keep the lights on in Vegas.